Hey everybody, Charlie here. Welcome back to Anno 1800. Oh, 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 we're starting things off great here, aren't we? A crack in the hull. Water in the hull! The overloaded ship could go could only go so far with this many supplies in its belly. A series of strong waves sends the cr crates flying, and the boat's stomach soon explodes. Cracks pierce the hull where the cargo hit, and trickles of water pop one after the other throughout the storage space. Oh my god. So, I mean, we're just gonna try to craft it. We don't have our crafter lady anymore. We'll try to improvise a water pump, I guess. Your crafty crew has a solution for everything. Using communication tubes as the pump's body and the spare metal sheets as paddles, the sailors manage to assemble what could pass for a proper water pump. It takes a good dozen men to make it work, but they buy enough time for proper repairs. We're still gonna have to drop morale. We're adequately stocked, I know, thanks. Yeah, I know. All right. Wow, like, they're just, it's a really cool thing. The expeditions are really cool. I, I, I mean, I'm sad that we lost our crafter, but expeditions are really cool. So we should be doing pretty well with sheep now. We only have one clothing maker, so we could get another one over here, I guess. That should be fine. And then let's upgrade this so it doesn't get too far. Uh, we can upgrade this one as well. And this one as well. Now everything will just keep going over here. This is 100% my island, damn it. Leave it alone. I will just keep buying back the shares, although I really would rather not. Like, I don't want to. Charleston. A special visitor awaits at your harbor and wants to become part of your city. A special visitor? At my harbor, you say? Who is it? Return from expedition, huh? Return from expedition. Who is it? Our cruise was just as full as last time. Again, like, tell me details. Who the hell is it? A special visitor tells me nothing. And it's not in the notifications. You know? I just want to get this. I just want to get the silly animals. So how can I tell who the visitor is? I guess it's two bakers now. We gotta equip the baker in the trade union. Replaced input. Expedition plus 10 crafting. Yeah, well, we have, still have some of those. Well, uh, where is my trade union? Right here. We might as well put one of the bakers in there. You know, might as well. Since we have two of them now. These guys are really well stocked on pretty much everything. These guys are full on building supplies, and these guys are full on building supplies. Well, guys, I mean, granted, I, I know I can expand much faster. I, I'm just kind of trying to do everything and show you guys everything, and that's, that's kind of why we're maybe going a bit slower than usual here, but I'm having a blast with this, or I should say I had a blast with this. It doesn't look like I'm gonna be able to get the animals. Before this, with a lark this morning, before I have to kind of give up the game, because uh, the closed beta was always a temporary thing, and so it looks to me like this is probably uh, this is probably it. But if you like Dano, let me know in the comments. If you want me to maybe take a look at keep continuing it when the game comes out in final release, uh, we can do so. We have apparently only three red peppers because we keep shipping them to the mainland. That's why. And then goulash is here. What does it take to make goulash again? No captain could ask for more. Oh boy. Oh boy. No captain could ask Expedition for returns more. early! After weeks of trials and tribulations, your expedition comes home safe. You have captured a wild animal. The crew toasts the success of your zoological expedition. This can only aid studies of the natural world. We get butterflies, plus 20 attractiveness. We get goats. This is a, a, a set of domestic animals, plus 10 attractiveness. And then we have the California gull, plus 20 attractiveness. Also, if we take it on an expedition, we get plus 20 navigation. That's pretty special. Welcome back, Vernon. Welcome back. 
So, empty compounds, huh? Can we uh, get some butterflies in here? And the goats, domestic animals, cool. And uh, maybe the California gull. She's amazed by my zoo. Oh, isn't that nice? Oh, isn't that nice? Look at this. Look at this, the buildings, the buildings, they're already made. Oh, wow, cool. So this is where the California gull is, right? And then we have the, the goats over here. Yes. And this is where the butterflies are. Oh, that's awesome. And then these guys are just all gonna come in and look at the zoo animals. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Our reputation's going up now, boys. And they're gonna come in and they're gonna spend money here too. We're making a lot of money now. They're gonna come in here and spend money. My global population is gonna keep climbing, I'm sure. We're gonna get lots more demand for artisan type stuff. We still have an empty plot here in our zoo. We can keep expanding it, make it bigger and bigger with all those plots of land. Oh my God, it's so great. Ah, uh, this game, I, I like it a lot. Uh, if you guys want me to keep playing this after it's released, please let me know in the comments because I'm open to it for sure. I mean, there's a lot of games I'm open to playing, but this, this is definitely one of them. We have another quest here too. Would like to organize a barbecue. Provide the resident with 14 sausages and 14 bread. A competitor's island is under sea. Wait, how do I... Wait. Concerne... Wait, who are you? You're in a state of war. <gasps> That's my friends! That's my friends! Willie! You dick! Willie! Yeah, serves you right, you asshole. I'm gonna send three gunboats to my friends. Get the hell out of here. Where that naughty shit would got to. This is the, the yeah, Regent. It's gonna just keep hauling bricks. I don't think the Regent needs to haul any more bricks, honestly. I think you can just come right back here with those bricks. I think you can come right back here with these bricks. I don't need these trade routes anymore. The bricks can stop. But like, dude, Willie, you're pissing me off. And I'm gonna declare war on you if you keep it up. Quit it, quit it. All right, I want, declare war is what I want, but it ain't gonna happen. Can I do trade rights with you? Flatterer. <laughs> the high chances never mean anything. I'm definitely not giving you money. Maybe there was good in me once. And then it died overnight. Medium low. I'm gonna give my my friend Princess King here some money. Doesn't look like it's gonna work. Fire in Charleston. I, I clicked it. Yeah, she declines it. Fine. She never accepts my gifts. Why is the fire out of control? Really? Is there no? No, there's there's a fire department in range. It just takes a while to get there. It looks like it's on its way right now. But it looks like I'm gonna need another one, so we'll get uh, we'll get another one. Yeah, we got fire department handling it. It's not a big deal. I mean, it is going out of control, right? It, it's. Yeah, he wants me 40,000 for non-aggression pack. No thanks. Absolutely not. No. We will be taking uh we'll be, we will be taking military action against you. Absolutely. I stand by my friends, okay? I stand by my friends and I, this is no exception. All right. So Look at her. She's got frigates. She's ready to rock. You. I'm gonna. I'm going back to war with you. Screw you. I'm going back to war with you. You attacked my friends. Screw you. You won't Yeah, you like me, don't you? But you, you don't like me anymore. You, you, you're gonna lose. Yeah, yeah. I am picking a fight with some of my own size. 
Look at his size compared to mine. Military's very even. So is our economies. But you know what the difference is between me and him? Nebuchadnezzar, let's get, get you out of the waters. Let's get you safe. Get my trade boat safe. Military vessels. Let's get you turned this way. You can't go after this. Are you after my... You're kind of out here near my other city here. I kind of don't want you out there. I'm going to get my gunboat and stuff in here. And then how are we doing this public mooring? I need to deliver... I need to deliver uh, windows here. So before we send the ships out that way... Where are those ships at? Hey, you guys. Come on back. As you're heading out that direction, I would like you to take them some windows on your way. If you could, please. Stations. Actually, this gunboat can do it. But I'd rather you guys travel as a group. No peace. No peace. New orders. Not until you stop attacking my friends. Uh... Windows. Yeah, here. I'd like you to take, let's say, 20 windows on the gunboat. And then how about we also do... Uh, we could do some weapons as well. You're going to hold the... Stations. Yeah, you're going to hold those. You've got the Congrave rocket. I'm going to leave you actually here. The fire has Comet, been just come on over here. Expedition naval power. Naval power 20%. I probably should put this on expeditions. Can I take this away? Can I... Uh, let me get closer. I need to take this away. The Vernon still here, yeah. Um, can I... Man, I just can't get close enough. Can I drop this off? Let's take this off, good. Get some rest. We'll le we'll save that rocket. Ready. We'll save that Congrave rocket for expeditions. Speaking of which, are there any more expeditions available? Because I would love to know if there's any more expeditions available. More zoo animals would be nice. I'm I'm a big fan of the zoo animals. She's small, but she's key. All right, Endeavor. Uh, yeah, the flagship is going to go, I think, to this island. I'm going to send my flagship out this way. Uh, we got some boats happening really close to our waters here, actually. We got some boats coming in. What's happening here? Oh, yeah, Willie's no, getting his shit bombarded. Stations. That's right. Chase him down, boys. Chase him down. Don't let him get away. Don't let him... That ship, that schooner, I want that trade. I want that taken out of here. That's right. Take it out. It's done. Excellent. Nope, head this off. Get this guy too. Let's go gunboats. Let's go gunboats. These guys are taking care of this. The cannons here are gonna be fine. Yeah, they can handle that boat, no problem. We'll chase this one away. Oh, it's gonna turn around. That's a mistake. You probably shouldn't do that. Ah ha ha! This will teach you to mess with my friends, Willie. Stations. That's right, Willie. Your boat's on fire. What now? Okay, we just shot it down. Let's go back this way. Let's go hang out. Let's go hang out next to our friend. Just chill out there. That's like right next to my city, like right next to my city. Actually, having a port on this side would be a good idea. Then I could just come right across the water and help her out. Hey, there's an idea. Let's do that. If I grab another... Does it take a... I think it actually takes... Sailing Shipyard, Harbor, Depot... I think it does. We could do a cannon tower out this way. This will shoot at any of Willie's ships that are coming out this way. It'll shoot at Willie's ships. That'll be nice. 
Uh, we'll also get... We have two cannons out this way, so we're pretty well protected here. We can take our fleet and take our fleet out onto this side. And we'll start expanding this way. Where is my flagship? Are you part of this? Ready the ropes. Hey, Vernon. Stop for a second. I want you to have the... The Congrave rocket. And the Baker can go on your ship, too. I want you to be ready for another... New orders and I want you to be ready for another expedition when it happens. So we'll course. leave you here like this. Uh, Nebuchadnezzar. We'll get you a little closer, see if we can offload this material. These, this, these guys don't need to be, like, right on my docks. These, these things are going to take care of me pretty well. These cannons are going to take care of me pretty well. The schooner here. We'll leave you out here with the, the bricks that you have. We'll send the rest of my fleet out this way. So that we're ready to deal with Willy whenever he goes after our friends. We'll just leave our boats out here. In this water. To deal with Willy. Although honestly, dealing with Willy could happen right here actually too. If Willy wants to come and handle us, he can come out and do it here too. Because, I mean, these guys are taking care of themselves okay. And with these three boats helping out, like, Willie's not going to be able to do anything to this. This lady has so many boats. Is this sea not gilded by desert sand? I'm really happy she's on my team because she's got a lot. <gasps> okay, I thought she was on a. I thought this was Willie's land, but it's this island over here. I mean, we could maybe take this out. We just hang out out here outside their cannon range and just attack their ships as they come out. That's not a bad idea. We have the we have the military Fleet might to do that. Orders. Like we have the military might to do that. Instead of protecting instead of protecting King near King. Fleet moving in convoy. We can then in, we can instead come on down here, hang out uh, over here outside of the range of her cannons, moving of convoy. his cannons and just take out like everything. We got gunboats and frigates. We can take them all out. We can hit really hard. Attention for the Admiral. I like this idea. I'm gonna move my ships uh, out here near Willy. And then as all these boats come out of his port, we'll just start picking them off away from here until he's got no navy left and then we can walk in. Just like a battle of attrition kind of thing, you know? I have no idea how to deliver this stuff. Store the requested amount of goods on your island and confirm the resident's conclusion message. If the resident's message has disappeared, click on the quest giver on your island. Okay. So, I have the prerequisite stuff, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure I have that stuff. He wants 14 bread and 14 sausages. Is for the kids. More likely find me I don't have the sausages. I need more sausages. I need another slaughterhouse. I don't have enough people making this for the slaughterhouse. Uh, we'll put another one here. And then we'll connect this to a street like this. Sounds good. So this is two additional slaughterhouses. We need more workers now, though. Wow, a huge worker deficit here now, actually. I did not see that coming. Huge worker deficit. All right. Let's check out the waters around Willy here. So, Willy, you're not going to be able to go this way. Because our boats will get you this direction. And our military is right here. To cut you off from going this direction. So, this fleet... Yeah, you guys are just like, shit, we can't go anywhere. That's what I want. Uh, I want to get these gunboats. I want to get a couple of these gunboats, actually, to head this direction. Oh, here we go. We'll just say shoot here. Shoot him. No, don't follow. Do not pursue. Do not pursue. I just want Willie to see that we are stronger than him. Oh god, here we go. What is this? Rescue mission! We received news of a marine accident. It is our duty to rescue who and what we can. 
We need naval power. Nice. Highly likely. Force is likely as well. Diplomacy. I don't have anything for diplomacy, but we can get specialists, goods, and machines and consumables. Okay. Well, we have the Vernon ready to go for our expeditions. It's equipped with stuff. We have more force here, more naval power here. Uh, we don't need anything for crafting, it looks like, so we can get the baker out of here. We'll leave the uh, 46 fish, and we'll just go up to 50, and this will be nice, so... I'm not going to accept Have peace you with you. You? you didn't teach me anything. All right, all of this is ready to go. We don't have diplomacy settled, though. We don't have any diplomatic challenges. But we do have pretty good stuff for naval power. I can't do anything with the, the item socket, but... More force. Sounds good. Go for it. Babes know that the rivers All you go. Alright. Alright, the fleet Attention. is just kind of wandering around here. I would like them to stop these boats from leaving. Do not allow these boats to leave the harbor. So I need to kind of... I, I need to somewhat spread out so that we can stop them from, from getting up where they want to go. Attention for the Admiral. These boats can work, move their way in a little bit. As long as this can't see me. Like, if this can shoot, then I'm too close, right? Yeah, so we're just going to kind of close in on this a little bit. Okay, this thing, we're too close. Back up, we're too close. Back up, guys. I'm confident it's ready to go. I like how that thing can still shoot me even though my boat has moved. Like, the cannonball's already on its way and somehow it just moves. It's kind of silly. Stations. Let's get away. Alright, what's the newspaper say? Relations sour. Uh, how about no? How about we go, uh, needs consumption down. And then we'll do more happiness over here. How's that sound go? Sometimes nice to have tangential news. Fleet ready. Attack. Of course, you know what's best. Attack. To fire. You know what? The trick is to invest. Yeah, take it out. Hit, hit him hard. Moving to coordinates. I think uh, I'm gonna move I these boats. No There's the city's starting to to see me, to see me here. I don't think I can actually lock them in as long as those as long as this can bombard me from such such distance. I don't think I can actually stop them from getting out of their harbor. Attention for the admiral. But I like I can at least put pressure on them, right? Like there's a lot of pressure happening here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Keep hitting them. Move this boat out of there. It's going to get hit. Go, go, go. Attack. You can rely on a ship under attack. All right, my frigate's not doing anything. You, get out of there. Come on. Come out this way. I want all of these boats actually to come right out here. We'll start we'll start locking this down. Cuz a lot of his boats want to come that way. If we separate his islands that way, that'd be nice. Because they're working their way around this island to go to his other island. So if I can lock that down. I, honestly, I want to just bring my boats in here and just take this cannon out. But it's really well fortified. Like, this is it's too well fortified for me to be able to do that. But I want to landlock him. I don't want him to be able to leave. Stations. But the best I can do is interrupt his trade routes, which is what I'm doing right now. Frigate first class. Fire! Engage. Engage this boat. Shoot it. Engage. Why are you shooting at that? You silly, you what the hell are you doing? Why are you shooting that? It makes no sense. Video game. Yeah, he's going to have to keep repairing his boats. Alright. I want to get 
all of you guys. Is there any way for me to tell them to like stay put and just fire at anything that passes? Because it seems like impossible to do that. These guys should be individual now. This guy's charging right at me. Good for you. Good for you. Good for you. <laughs> like, right at me. He's not messing around. Yeah, let's get away from the island, though. I don't want you to... Yeah, here we go. Take this out. Hit this guy. Hit him. He's right on top of you. I don't know what they're shooting at. Like, they seem to be shooting at... I don't know, like this boat? Like, what are you shooting at? Guys, Please guys. No, no ceasefire. No ceasefire, I wanna, I wanna take you out. Oh. What are you doing? I don't know what my boats are actually shooting at. Can I select all gunboats? See, I wish I could select all boats of a certain type. Maybe I can... Hey, the Endeavor. It's over here, ready to settle this island. I think... I think that's a good idea. This has got a lot of stuff, so... Let's go for it. You just him nice. We got ourselves a trading post. Uh -huh. Also, she bought another share of this land, so I have to keep buying this back. It's really annoying. So I'm not gonna be able to do that because. Take it. I'll still be there in one way or other. We never turn on ours. This frigate. Make sail. Me luck just goes from bad to worse. What's their military strength now? It's actually still pretty high. What? Am I not taking out any boats? Am I just injuring them so they can come back? Why is my... Alright, hold on. Why are you guys all spread out now? Wait, what are you doing? Why are you all spread out? My boats are all spread out now. I I want them grouped. Alright, my frigate has chased down this boat and is pretty much about to destroy it. Looks pretty promising. It's done. Awesome. Let's get that frigate back with the navy here. Uh... I really want to take this island out. I just don't see that as being something I can do. Because the range on those cannons are ridiculous. Sheets and braces. Fleet ready. Let's get this these guys moving this way. I still want to attack all these ships. There's moving so much there's so many ships moving back and forth through here. I want to take them out. Moving to coordinates. We'll go individual moving for now. We can get them moving as fast as they can in that direction. This frigate's moving forward. Fleet awaiting orders. Grouped. Fire. We did some damage. Fleet embarking. I want you to stay right here. Fleet on the Group up and stay right here. You can shoot at anything that comes at you. Of a virtuoso. Townspeople. Okay. This this thing again, like what how do I Okay, this guy, right? He wants to join my 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 people, right? So Where do I see him? Our cruise was just as full as last time. Hey, look at this, it's another miner. Production. Equipped and trade unit, another miner. Production would be good, but I don't really need production. I'm maxed out on everything. Right now, I just want to destroy my enemies. Yeah, 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 this. Just just shoot him dead. Oh, 
Oh yeah, that's what I'm looking at right there. See, now they're moving towards us. I don't want him to move. Oh, he's he's down. He's down. He doesn't even know it. He's he's super dead. Doesn't even know it. Frigates are completely taking him out. We have flotsam. Oh, look at all that flotsam. Look at all that flotsam. Look at all that flotsam. That's a shame. Don't worry, we'll just pick it up, you know. We'll pick it up for you, man. Don't worry. We'll, we'll, we'll get it for you. What are you guys doing? What are you guys doing? No, 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 no. Don't chase them back. Don't take the bait. Don't take the bait. Damn yous. Look. Here's another ship. You can destroy this guy. How's that sound? Really? Did you guys miss or what? That schooner is actually pretty well armored up. It got through though, man. It's like it really got through. It's We'll just destroy it on the way back. That's fine. Here we go. This one. Destroy! Destroy! <laughs> Shoot it! Oh, it's getting tattered. Oh, it's getting real hammered now, isn't it? Come on now. Yeah! Oh, one more shot, please. There it is. It's down. Don't chase it. Don't chase Oh my god, it's not down. Chase it. It's worth it. Finish it. I don't want it repaired. Go. I don't want it repaired. Go. Take it out. It's a surgical operation. One ship shoots one ship. Shoot it. Shoot that ship. Thank you. Now get out of here. Get out. Get out of there. Get out of there. Oh my god. Well, I lost the ship. Overextended. Super overextended that. <laughs> Naval battle is kind of fun, actually. It's... And he's repairing all the ships. Like, all these are just super damaged all the time. So he'll just repair them up and then bring them back. But this is this is a really fortified front. I'm wondering if it'd be better to go after this one. But every time I go after one of these cannons, they always wreck me. Uh-oh. Untold perils await us. Good God. It's another snow globe. Snow globe! Sails frozen, food rotten, and a ship on the brink of breaking. It's a blizzard. All notion of time and direction has been lost. A never-ending tempest of snow surrounding the ship, blurring the limits between night and day, or sky and sea. Stalactites have imprisoned your sails, binding them to the masts and making them creak under the unexpected weight. Your crew fear they may break, but should anyone venture outside while violent winds whip the upper deck? So, the force uh, that we have from the sword gives us plus 10% chance to succeed here, so we'll try this. Climb the mast and detach the frozen sails. The task is far from easy. Your sailors have good strength and are used to climbing the mast, but they lack either luck or skill when it comes to speed. Before they can reach the foremast, the foresail breaks out of its bounds and flaps wildly against the weakest mast, while the other sails continue to foster stalactites of increasing length and weight. The foremast emits a shrilling sound of protest. Once your longboat goes in... Fire all guns and shake off the ice. Uh, we actually have a plus 40% chance of this because of naval power. Let's, plus 40%, I'm in. The stalactites are dealt with. In a bold act of defiance towards logic and prudence, your artillery men fire their cannons to send precisely gauged vibrations throughout your ship. The foremast protests but resists, while the pikes of ice... Uh, Parasitis... Parasitising? It's sails? Is that what that is? I never... I don't know what that is. Uh, it's sails break and, uh... Rain on the deck on, in a cacophony of tingling sounds. Your maimed ship has but to wait for the blizzard to run out of breath now. It's so, like, dramatic and 
poetic and just it's angle. awesome but like trying to read it out loud is I stumble over my words sometimes I don't use poetic language like that like common speech so when I when I hear it when I see it like that it's it kind of gets me sometimes as you know I am not a smart man <laughs> huge worker surplus over here uh, I, I wish I could see like a readout of all my stuff just I would love that like add it to the game please a, a UI where it shows me a list of all this stuff instead of having to click here right show me this like over here you know or like right, right here or right here show me that somewhere you know that would be a really great thing to be able to see I would love that but I can't see that stuff so I have to click here and find out. Lots and lots of farmers. We have plenty of sausages. We're doing really well on like everything in this island. Uh, but what we're not doing well on is like actually making After stuff for helping. I'm wondering, we should probably get the goulash started over here. We don't have any artisans over here though. So getting goulash right here, right now, the it takes it takes artisans to actually produce the goulash. I mean, we have a lot of supply of this stuff. We just don't have the artisans to make it happen, I don't think. We can give it a shot. We can give it a shot, see what happens. We'll put it on the put it on the on the corner right here. We just need to upgrade some people's homes. Uh to get let's see, get more workers, let's say. This will swap us out for some more workers. Uh, then we could... How are we doing on, like, bread and stuff? We're doing okay on bread. We're kind of doing okay on everything, honestly. There's 80 schnapps and greatly increasing over here. Hey, trade routes. Let's create a route between this island and uh, this island. And I would like to load the schnapps... Yeah, load the schnapps here. Not 50. 50 is a bit much. Let's do 25. And we'll unload them in Charlestown. And then we'll take... Uh, I don't know. We have coal on this island. What we don't have is iron a whole lot. So we'll take some of the iron. Like, let's say 30 iron. And we'll unload that here. We'll just go back and forth with that with... The independence. Sounds good. Go. Excellent. Alright. How's my military doing over here? Are we are we taking out Willie's ships? We gotta be holding him down, right? I mean, like, he's not attacking our friends anymore. He's definitely not doing that. He's not going after Princess King, and that's kind of the important thing. And these ships are almost destroyed. Like, he's able to repair them. He keeps getting... Keeps being able to repair them, and it's annoying. I wish I could take them out forever. If I ever went to war with... Uh... Her? That would be a major problem. Like, her navy is super powerful. Like, I'm willing to bet her military might is... It does exceed okay, mine say. by quite a bit. We're, we're doing much better here now. Like, versus him, he's he's basically defeated here. What is he to you? You have a 31 reputation with Anne. That's interesting. I can offer Anne a gift. I can't do any peace trees with her. I want peace, but I, I can't get any trees with her. My military strength is getting pretty high, though. I might almost have hers beaten. I like how it's high chance and it always fails. I just high chances never work. What do you have for quests? I'd like to keep our relationship above 90. You have no quests, so I guess. Where's Willie's ships? Is Willie done? How is this boat so fast? Like, this is the wind. The wind is going that direction. She's going against the wind, and that's how fast she's going? She may look sweet, but she'll hit below the belt if she this has is a to. clipper. 
It's a really big ship. All hands up the ready. Speaking of big ships. The Fugitive. The local authorities are looking for the refugee you've taken in. A man in rags offer you, offers you his services in a harbor, arguing that he'd do any odd job for food and a chance at joining your crew. Unlike other temporary hires, he grows on your sailors, filling in whenever there's work that needs doing, adding to the ship's spirit, and disputing debates over the expedition's course. His skills testify to a life beyond that of a common sailor, but your crew respects his secrecy. As your ship leaves the harbor, a patrolling warship stops it. They're looking for a political dissident, and the description matches your new recruit. Is it a fight you're looking for? Plus 40% on that. We're gonna do that. Plus 40%. Naval power is strong. The patrol is not impressed by your ship's armament. Your crew flings slurs at the inspection warship before scattering below decks, deploying unsteady cannons that bump against closed hatches and very audibly cursing their lack of ammunition. Trying to refrain his laughter as his own crew deploys uh, brand new ordnance rifles, the patrol captain asks your sailors to demonstrate how they intend to overpower him. Plus 40%. Uh, okay, demonstrate. <laughs> it takes but one accurate shot to demonstrate power. Giving up on shooting all cannons, your sailors focus on firing the single best shot of their lives. The cannonball flies over the warship's railings and crushes their ma main mast, causing wood and metal to rain down on the patrol guards below, giving your ship a handy window in which to flee. The fugitive leaves your crew at the next island, grateful but unwilling to aggravate your feud with the local authorities. Oh, too late. Wait! People are dying out Are you kidding me? This is all going on while I'm doing this? Oh. I just destroyed one of his ships while that was happening. Are you trying to tell me that all of this is happening in real time with no pause while I'm doing that? That is... that is not good. I would like to experience the expedition, like really take it in, but if I'm in the middle of a war... Like, whoa! That no pause is wild. I'm gonna be a little bit bold here. Because this guy looks like he's wounded. Mm. Nope, he's going away. We're just gonna reposition the frigate a little bit. We're just gonna reposition them a little bit. I wanna make sure that we're bombarding them really, really well. Like, we're locking him in here. Like, they can't fire the cannons over top. Right? So they can't fire the cannons over top of this, I don't think. So we just get ourselves, you know, facing, facing in a direction that'll help us in bombarding from that direction. Yeah, we're ready to rock. So the AI is going to try to come out of there and he'll be like, oh, there are boats. And then he'll stop and turn around and be like, oh shit, there are boats. And then he'll leave. That's the hope anyway. But it looks to me like this guy does want to pick a fight. And I'm ready to do so. And by fight, I mean absolutely obliterate him. You are sunken. Yeah, you're completely destroyed. So we're just, like, completely annihilating his ships. Which was the entire pur purpose. It was the entire point. Uh, can we pick up this stuff? This is all this flotsam. I want to pick this stuff up. He's got a bunch of it. And we can just pick it up and take it into our own ship. Yeah, just pick up the stuff. We will pillage and loot your trade ships until you pay me. And where's the option for me to request, like, demands from them? Like, where's that option? Why is it that they can request, like, the AI can ask me, hey... Do you want a ceasefire? Pay me 20,000 gold and we'll do a ceasefire. Like, the AI can ask that of me. But I can't seem to ask that of the AI. Like, I would love to go... You know, request a peace treaty. Request a ceasefire. And, like, demand. Make additional demands of that, you know? 
Did I actually click that? I didn't click that. No way. I definitely didn't click that. No, I didn't click. He just somehow has Why? better... He just somehow has a better reputation now of me. Oh, are you a little lost boat? I just want to go back to shore. All I want to do is go back. Too bad, little boat. It's not your day. It's not your day, little boat. You're not going back home today. Sorry. You're just not. Uh, warehouse appears to be full. So we'll go ahead and give it a massive upgrade. How's that sound? Uh, any more upgrades? Loading ramps? Nope, we're not using all the loading ramps. Huh. Can we make more ships? Ship of the line. Oh my god, we can make these big ass ships. 4,000 hit points. Twice the hit points of a frigate. 50 naval power? We can send ship of the line on our expeditions from now on. Oh, I want to make one. I want to make one. This will be our new expedition ship. Then we'll have lots of naval power. Fast three-masted trade ship with an increased cargo hold. Those are clippers. So the clipper ones... The clippers don't have naval power. Interesting. Can we make two of these? It's 250 for the upkeep cost on this. As opposed to 100 for the frigates and 25 for gunboats. Yeah. Uh, well, I want, like, I want big ships. I want a bunch of ships. So let's make All a bunch more ships. Already. All hands at the ready. Tangled. <laughs> The Sargosso Sea was made famous by Columbus's sailors and their fear of entrapment. Indeed, the vast columns of algae that stretch across the diamond waters look ominous, their menace confirmed by the ship standing still in their midst. Your own vessel avoids the brown plants when a call rings from the struck ship. There are still sailors aboard. You have no proper rescue equipment and risk getting entangled yourself should you try to help. Yeah. Hate how this stuff. This should pause the game, honestly. All the, the way the world is working, this should pause everything so you can assess. It really should. Um, help from a distance and fire a roped harpoon at the ship. Naval power plus forty percent. A perfect shot. With just the right balance between propulsion and aim, the harpoon strikes the stranded ship's starboard. Uh, Without damaging too much of its hull, the rope is collected by the crew on board, and they bind it to their railings before waiting for your instructions. Good seaman is known in we don't get a bonus for any of these, uh, but tie the buoy to the improvised uh, sh zip line and create. Tra See, oh, look at this! I can't respond to this and do this. Encourage sailors to climb the rope and cross the distance on their own. Let's create the transport device. <laughs> The buoy comes undone in the first rescue attempt. No sooner has the sailor climbed onto the contraption than it slips and swirls, sending him crashing into the water. It ripples part of the algae. Well, we failed it, but I want to I want to get back to the freaking war because I have a feeling my ships are being destroyed. Not the worst manifest. Sometimes you just have to take a cudgel to other people's heads. Frigate first class. Sometimes you do, yeah. See, look at this. All these guys can just they can just shoot me now. They're just shooting me now. Like, all of this stuff is in range to be shot at now. Because I wasn't there to, like, tell them no, you know? It's silly. The rest of the, like, the whole... This place should not happen. Like, you should not have the time and war and all that stuff continuing to go when you're in the expedition screen. It just makes no sense. Because it takes up your whole... It'd be different if it was like the story happens over here and you can respond to it at your time. But like, if you have to stop everything... New orders. That's just silly. Stations. I can't pick up the flotsam. You have a window on you. I would really, really like to, to take this out. I want to take his entire harbor out. 
It'd be easier to take this one. But only just. Like, only because we can get... I'm actually not sure. Because he's only got two... He got two guns here. Two big guns. So I just don't think it's possible to take him out. I think he's too well fortified. Aye. That said, though, uh, his boats can keep coming at me all they want. I'll just keep destroying his boats. New orders, Admiral. Because that's easy. His boats can't get away, so... I'll let him continue to use his weapon supply, use up all of his steel, keep making more boats. His economy should be pretty weakened by all of this. Somehow he still has a great economy. I'm not sure how that's a thing. I can flatter him if I want to, or I can insult him. I don't know. One final look. One final look. That's exactly what this episode has been. This video has been one final look. Rum shortage. Uh, okay, we'll edit this to say that we would like you to not consume things. And also make you happy with this big thing here. Haha, <laughs> cool. Publish it. It took minimal revision. Alright, guys, I think. I think this is it. I mean, I would love to complete the expeditions and stuff, but I, I gotta go. Um. Thank you so much for watching. This has been Anno 1800. It's a closed beta. It's not representative of the final game. I'm hoping things get worked out like that. I'm hoping some of these quests that are seemingly impossible to complete or bugged out uh, get fixed. And I'm kind of hoping that the expedition screen and the final version of the game uh, actually pauses the game because having all of this run, I mean, all of my ships will just automatically follow them into this area where I don't want them to. And then they all can just die while I'm doing the expedition screen. And it. That's just a bad, that's just a bad, uh, it's a bad thing. Just a bad thing. But, guys, I think that's gonna do it for me. Thank you so much for watching Anno 1800 with me. Leave me comments, and, uh, we'll see you guys next time. It's been fun. Bye.